Okay. Onward! This is for the subscribers! Yeah, that's the way to do it. Alright, I gotta fucking really get hit with that. There you go. Fucking Christ. Fuck you. I did it. Well done. Like, comment, and subscribe if that kill was impressive. What? What are you? It's B. Go away. I don't want to. I don't want to be in this place. <laughs> uh, sorry. We just lost all the subscribers we had. <laughs> I think he's spying on you. It's like, holy shit, is that X? Ah, yes. The classic dodge the fire things. Seriously, this is in, like, every Mega Man X game. It is, like, in every game. We need to have that one level with the, like, randomly spewing fire. How will people know it's a Mega Man? How will people know it's a video game? Where your timing on certain jumps actually matters. I mean, it matters a little bit less when it's not going to knock you into a bottomless pit and kill you, but... No, fuck you. I saved him. Thanks! I, I saved him, and now I'm going to die for it. You saved him from the tentacle robots. Gotta save all them reploids from the tentacle mon- Oh, my oh God. Oh, God, there's another one. Do you have another giga thingy? Uh, uh, uh. There you go. Well, for what it's worth... <laughs> Uh, this is the best spawn point of all time. Are you kidding me? Maybe he'll give... No, he just, he just starts running at you right away. That could have been better. I wasn't terrible, though. Wow. He keeps shooting me, like, right as I go to shoot the thing. Which interrupts it. Of course. These guys are kind of bullshit. I don't Whoa, remember them like being... Flying. Yeah. <laughs> no, these things go fucking far. Boom. See, I don't remember this level being this much of a pain. Oh, do you just have to hit the glass... The green things? Yeah. Um... But that's also why it's a pain, because two of them are on top. Yeah. Hey, there's a dude there. Give me help. Thanks. Got it. Okay, that... God. Still hate it. Yeah. Like, it would be easier if the whole thing was a hitbox. Yeah. But why would they make a game easy? I don't know. They, it's all about the bullshit hard difficulty. Get good. Ah, oh, shit, I don't know which door I should go through. You played Dark Souls? I, I have played Dark Souls. You were playing it before we started recording. I thought I was. And now you're playing another game where you collect souls from the things you kill. Funny how that works. What are you even supposed to do? I don't... You don't have, like, a vertical jump thing. I'm wondering if I need one of the other armors. There's also a heart... Uh, health tank... Health upgrade. Yeah, there's, there's a heart and... And dude. Maybe I go I this way. If that, if the microphone caught that. I think it did. <laughs> doop -a doop I got an email. That's all that is. How dare you get emails? I get emails all the fucking time. <sighs> okay, should I go through this top door or this bottom door? Um, I feel like I feel top like the, I feel like is the... making you work for something that's probably not going to be as good. So go to the bottom. The most straightforward path. No straightforward path? Yeah. I'm gonna miss out on cool things. It's gonna be all your fault. I feel like having one up higher is a trick. Do you have to find another fucking red thing? Probably. Okay, well if you die, go through the top one and see what happens. Not bad. 
I don't think you can kill the bees. Go away. Go away. Barf. Who? Fuck you. I'm gonna die. Don't die. Do you get sub tanks in this one too? Yeah. Eventually. I already missed one oh. of them. Like, I know where one of them is, but it's kind of hard to get to. Let's see what's behind door number two. It's literally the same thing. But different. The illusion of choice. Do you want to fight the boss in this arena or a slightly different arena? That could have gone better. Yeah, I could have. Oh. There's a dude to save in this one. There probably is in the other one, too. Yeah, probably. Like, I think it probably literally doesn't make any difference. What is the purpose of the bees? To block your shots. That's literally it. Seriously. Pretty much. Like, you can't even go fast enough for them to, like, hit you. Huh. That's kind of dumb. I mean, I, I could see if they were in, like, the Amazon stage or something, but you're in a volcano. Right? Did that even register a hit? You are about to die. But so is he. Ah, uh, but I'm out of rocks. Oh no. Oh. That kind of sucks. Yeah. Look at the bright side. At least there's no, like, insta-kill spikes or anything. Well, yeah, that would just be cool. I mean, based on what else is in this game, it would be about <laughs> par for the course. Saved him. Nice. I think any boss arena with death spikes is a dick move. I only know of, I think, two Mega Man games where that's been a thing. Uh, let's see, I know there's one in X5, but it's like it's actually done in like a more fair way. Yeah, I think that's the one I was thinking of. And then in Mega Man and Base, one of the bosses you fight has, it's like a platform in the middle of the um, arena. And then there's spikes on like both sides of it. And then you have the the way you do the extra damage is you use the ice wall to like slide him into the spikes. But it's really easy to get knocked in yourself, and it's annoying as hell. That whole game is annoying as hell. I look forward to playing it eventually someday. <laughs> oh and, man, and it I being am... it being our first like true rage quit game. The first game, we're just like, nope, we're no, done. No, we are not gonna finish this game. We'll get close. I don't know. Maybe it'll be. Maybe we can do it. It's just. Pre it's pretty much just the final boss rush. That's the huge pain in the ass. At least you can usually hit two of them with one rock. Yeah. That was a good one. That was way off. Oh, come on, you almost got him. You can do it! You missed. And I fired, and then I missed. 
And then I shot and then I missed. Got it. Hey! Dragonflies! Maximize! Or something. Congratulations! Boss time? I think so. Sweet. Like actual boss? Maybe, maybe not. Nope. Uh, this looks like a boss arena. That is purple fire. Are you fucking serious? Oh, good. You don't actually have to fight him. Oh, yes, you do. Is that fire insta death? Yes. Wow. I'm like, I'm like 99% sure of that. Well, that's bullshit. Yes. Hey, you know that really obnoxious mini boss you had to fight at the start? Let's make it do it two or three more times, and one of them is in an instant death arena. Maybe it's a good thing Cap Capcom stopped making Mega Man games. <laughs> well, okay, so X6 was kind of a pain in the ass. Clearly. It's, um, it's generally considered the last good one, right? And that is yep. insta death. Um, yeah, generally. So, like... X7 was awful. Like, so I heard. E even I will say X7 had way more issues than it should have. Um, that said, though, I actually really liked X8. I think X8 did a really good job. Hmm. But that is, that is kind of like the thing with making a series that everybody pretty much universally loves so they make they want more and you want to make more but if you don't have like the ideas for how to do it differently oh, or better God, fuck it's gonna end up sucking eventually and that was oh you're just right back out here like if, if a series goes on too long it's gonna start sucking yeah but at the same time, you can't end a series on a cliffhanger and just say, you know what, fuck it, we're done. Which is exactly what they fucking do with X. Mm. X8's ending, like, it made me hyped for X9, which does not exist. Of course. And so you also end up with stuff like that. It's like, yeah, we made a really good game, we are so confident that people are going to want another one, we ended it on a cliffhanger. Oh, it, it, it um... There's uh, it didn't do well enough, and now we can't make another one. Welp. Yeah. Um. Or Legends, Legends Three getting canceled. Yeah. When they were pretty much done with it. I don't even know why they did that shit. Like, what's the they're, fuck? They're assholes and they hate money. It was like their last chance to save the series, the Mega, the entire Mega Man name. And they were just like, no, it's, you know, fuck it. Maybe we'll see if Konami has a pachinko machine with them or something. <laughs> uh. Stop shooting me in the air, you piece of... Like, the worst part about this is there's, like, not a lot of room that it gives you. Yeah. And he takes up, like, literally a quarter of the screen. And a lot of times, he comes up on, like, the only platform you can stand on. Which is just a little bit bullshit. Come on. And, like, there's just no way to hit him in some areas. And this is just gonna keep scrolling forever until he dies, yeah? Yep. Of course. Got it. And now, magically, there's a way out. I mean, if you, if you were good enough at dodging him, that could go on for an hour. But as soon as he dies, suddenly there's a door. Yep. It is also a hot spot. Watch out! There are no. There are more fields of magmas. It's getting hotter. So take off all your clothes. I should be careful not to fall as I, like, make a faith jump. Oh my god. You're fucking with me, right? I wish. Uh, 
I don't even know what to say now. Like, even if it weren't such a pain in the ass, it would be annoying fighting the same mini-boss five times in a row. Mm-hmm. Like, even if it was relatively easy. See, I wouldn't mind it if it was relatively easy. Like, I, I would assume it would be just as time-consuming, but not as much of a pain in the ass, but... This is like padding to the extreme. Oh yeah, no, this is this is terrible. Like, we want this level to be a certain length, but we ran out of ideas for stuff to put in it, so you'll fight the same guy like four times. That that'll get us to about, you know, twenty minutes a level or so. Depending on how much you suck. Is the fire gonna oh it's up to the doors up there. I did it. It's dead. Is it can be boss time now? The further I go, the hotter it gets. The investigator must be this way. The investigator's area is Blaze Enix. Prepare yourself, just in case. Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. Oh my god. I'm so ready to be done with this fight. <laughs> no kidding. Look at all that Phazon. Wait, Phazon was blue, wasn't it? Yes. It's kind of a bluish purple. I... Ah, welcome! I've been waiting, I've been for, waiting you. for you! You are strong compared to the others. I was bored because there was some reploid left on the ground. Although I was not ordered to kill. It's too hard, isn't it? That's what she said. Being watching the points is lame, don't you think so? Let's fight to see who's the strongest. Let's fight to see who's the strongest. Go! <laughs> oh my! Oh my! Fuck you! Rock. <laughs> Just like in Pokemon, he should have double weakness to rock. He's he's fire and flying. Rock. I'm gonna rock your world. Fuck you. I'm trying to make puns. Also, stop being impossible to avoid. Fire flying! Double rock weakness. Uh, you can't Seriously, there's like no way to fucking avoid that You can't shit. stun lock him either, huh? Nope. Did my rock re really just break on the fucking uh, ceiling? Yep. Yeah. Uh, you've almost got him, but he's almost got you. This is gonna be close. Oh. Damn. I almost had it. Well, full health and all that. Yeah. Full energy. And this is where we fuck it up royally. <laughs> yeah, I'll just like die like instantly. <laughs> I'm gonna get ya! Scraw! See? Scraw! Oh my god, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. Wow. God, there's like no indication of when he's going to actually like dash up. Did he dash through the blade beam thingies that he does? Nope. Of course not. Fuck being able to actually dodge anything. You end up taking so many hits, not because you're bad at dodging, but because you literally can't dodge. And they don't even hit your projectiles. Oh, those do. Are you kidding me? Wow. Bullshit. Fuck you. Oh, but you got him. Nice. <laughs> Fuck you! You're... Bird ass face. Get fucked! Christ. Smells like fried chicken. You got a glowy. Are we about at the end of the episode? Yes, we are. Good. As soon as we do like the Yeah, we'll 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 do some saving and some post screen or whatever and then Ugh. And then we're yeah. done and we don't have to play the game anymore today. <laughs>
No, we gotta keep going. Well, we could, but... You, you got, got the, the magma, magma blade! blade. Oh, so it's like the thing that he was shooting at you. But I'm going to guess that if it hits enemies, it doesn't keep going. I got a power drive and an ultimate buster. Nice! Please, he makes an exodesticated robots, but his ability is far beyond others. He could research dangerous areas. All other members who fell behind were killed. Gate, who created Heat Nix, improved his powers and strengths. In order to prevent any more victims, Heat Nix was disposed deep underground. Okay. Nice! Save that shit. Cool. No! Next episode, we will continue the game. Will we? Will we? Well, yeah. Okay. Whenever the next time we play it is. Okay.